Hello, great to have you with us. We find ourselves today in the Dutch province of North Brabant in the city of Eindhoven. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we've got Europa League group stage action coming up for you. It's PSV up against Sturm Graz. Well, they've been very good so far, Derek, and these fans have certainly seen some exciting football. Let's hope they get the job done today. And the starting 11 for PSV. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, as you can see, the front two will mostly play together, but there will be times when they split, and that will then allow one of the midfield players to make a forward run between them. He will be a key player for them. And this Europa League group stage confrontation commences. <laughs> Olivier Boscalier. Davy Proper. And players waiting in the center. There it is! And just the ideal start! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. But the finish is so easy. He's given far too much time and space. He doesn't even have to jump. Poor defending, you have to say. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Wüthrich. Neat passing, confidence on the ball. That's excellent defending following the cross. Van Kinkel. Olivier Boscalier. Now what can they do from here? Must score! That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And he's fired over the corner. Well, he didn't trouble the goalkeeper, but it wasn't a straightforward chance, you've got to say. A 
Not a bad pass it was. Crossing possibilities. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Stankovic. Oh, a vital interception. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. How can he take them on and beat them? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And snuffing out the danger. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Stankovic. Now moving the ball impressively here. Now the timing of the pass, that little bit off. Olivier Boscali. Eran Zahavi. And he's through here. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Stankovic. Jancha. Well, possibilities in the centre. Jakob Jancha. Body on the line. Trailing as they are, they must make good use of this corner. Delivering it. The clearance wasn't decisive. Vital intervention. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Wüthrich. Stefan Hierländer for a pass that lacks quality. And the advantage, well, with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. And the problem not completely solved. And a time for composure on the ball. Well, as the stats tell us, PSV have been second best in terms of possession, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Can they take advantage? Well, no way through. Fine teamwork to win it back. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. So, getting close to the half-time interval, and it's going with home advantage, albeit not but... There's still danger here! Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. Gakpo, can he play it in? Van Hinko. Proper. Real chance. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. He doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Well, a 
second goal for them here. That is tackling of the highest order. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And the referee blows for a foul. Prepare. Perfect challenge. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And the main thing is they're currently on course to book their place. At... And so the second half is underway in this Europa League group stage confrontation. Max Boscali in possession. Gakpo. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Prepare. Couldn't grab hold of it. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, what a brilliant save that was. I can't believe he's kept that one out. Davy Prupper. Now he must favour the cross. Max. And there to intervene. He's protecting it well. Intercepting it intelligently. Gakpo. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Shot blocked, but still alive. Terrific piece of anticipation. A deft clearance. Max. Tremendous challenge. Stankovic. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. The cross is on. Jakob Jancha. Well, fantastic reflex action. Gakpo. Well, the hosts, as you can see, have enjoyed so much possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Songare. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free-kick situation? And a substitution in the offing. Oh, just over. So close. Well, it is close, Derek, but in the end, not close enough. He just can't get it down in time. Now could they make something happen? But they dealt with the threat posed. Ibrahim Songare. Options in the middle. But a goal to update you on in the Monaco match. Let's hear all about it from Alex Scott. Good save! Oh, a superb save! Well, as you'll have noticed, we had to cut Alex a bit short just then. Just to confirm, Real Sociedad have found the net in that game. And the match is level at 1-1. Well, they keep passing away.
And a throw-in it's going to be. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Losing possession here. Good, sir. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Breaking at pace. Will they profit from this situation? Well, he'll be irked with himself. Ran into an offside position. So, making the substitution now. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Well, he's lost it. Tremendous ball played through. And he's waiting in the centre, unaccompanied. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect. And then just look at the finish, Derek. He reads the flight perfectly and absolutely smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. There's just no stopping that. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Ljubic. And teammates to play it to. And nodding it just a bit too high in the end. And the danger is averted. And reading it absolutely superbly. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Philip Mwene. Promising possession, this. And he cuts in from the wing. Straight forward for the keeper. Prepare. Corner kick played in. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. A good and fair challenge. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Ljubic Nyangbo and so that is going to be that the final whistle here and they're in a pretty comfortable position because not only have they booked a place in the knockout stages it's still very much on for them to finish top of the group Stuart yeah you're absolutely right Derek it's job half done at the moment they'll still want to take that top spot though it could make all the difference going into the next round no two ways about it, he really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is. And this Europa League group stage confrontation commences.